Right guys, welcome to day 12 of the ICT Games Daily Dollop of Maths. Thanks for coming back. Um, we're keeping the maths bubbling over for year one and year two. Um, here we go. Uh, we're going to start uh, with our number square. We're, it's set to something tricky. Let's have a look. At, oh, it starts at 70. We're counting in ones. Uh, guys, make sure you're calling out. Make sure you love your mistakes. Uh, make sure uh, you're sat with an adult. Here we go. 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, and 90, 91, 92, 93, 94. Okay, we're going to stop there. Now we're at 94. Now we're going to count in tens. We're adding 10 each time. So 74, 84, 94. 104. Write that on the table with your finger. How would you write 104? Do you remember that placeholder? 104. 104. So 104. 114. That's tricky. 124. 134. 144. 154. 164. 174. Okay. Right, we're going to start at, let's have a look. Let's start at 100 and we're going to count in ones. 100, 101, 102, 103, 104, 105, 106, 107, 108, 109, 100 and, yeah, 110. Write that on the table with your finger. 110, 111, 112. 113, 114, 115, 116, 117, 118, 119, 119, 119, 119, 119, 120, 121, 122, 123, we'll 129 and 29, 29, 29, 130. Right, we'll stop there. Let's do a puzzle. Okay, right, we've got 127 here. What's one less? The, tw the 120 is going to stay the same. This digit is going to go down by one. It's going to be 126. Okay, now we're going up a square, which means 10 less. So, oh dear, that's tricky. Oh, this is a real year two -y, this one. So, 126. The six is going to stay the same. The 100 is going to stay, 100 is going to stay the same. This digit is going to go down by one. It's going to become a one. So, so it's going to be 116. Right, 10 less than 116. So, this is going to stay the same. This is going to stay the same. This is going to go down by one. The tens is going to go down by one, this one down to zero so it's 106 what's one more than 106 107 okay let's do this one 10 less than 106 oh, this is a real doozy uh, 96 10 less than 96 86 one less than 86 one less than 86 85. Oh, guys, that was a really tricky one. Well done. Okay. Here's my number line. Oh, let's switch off first. Ding. What number is that? Change your partner. It's more than 40. Yeah, it's 42. Do another one. Ding. What number is that? There's 60. It's more than 60. It's 60 something. Yeah, 63. Let's try it the other way. Ding. Right, it's less than 50. It's more than 40. There's 45. Yeah, 47. Turn it off. Hmm, there's 40. Is it 40-something? 
No, it's less than 40. It's in the 30s, isn't it? 30, there's 35. 1, 1, 35 is 36. There you go. Well done, guys. Okay, here we go. Counting in twos. Year ones definitely need to be able to do this. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty. And again, call out. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty. Okay, close your eyes. Open your eyes again. What's covered? Yeah, fourteen. Okay, close your eyes again. Open your eyes again. <laughs> what have we done? Let's try it out. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. Yeah, I've swapped the fourteen and the sixteen round. Can't fool you. Okay, let's go to counting in threes. Come on, year twos, counting in threes. Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, eighteen, twenty-one, twenty-four, twenty-seven, thirty. And again, three, six, nine, twelve. 15, 18, 21, 24, 27, 30. Right, close your eyes. Well done, year ones, if you're trying to join in with this, because this is tricky stuff. Here we go. What's covered with the star bar? 3, 6, 9, 12, 15. Yeah, 18. Close your eyes again. Oh, you know, peeping. I can see you peeping. Okay. Well done, year ones, if you're trying to join in with this. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 27, 27. Good job, guys. Okay, let's move on. Right, we've got our scales again. Now, uh, you can pause the video and see if you can work out which one's worth more. Okay. Okay, you pause the video. You might have got the answers now. Uh, I've got 7, add 2. I'm putting the biggest number first in my head and adding on 2. A seven add two, let's find seven. There's seven. Add two, one, two. So that's seven add two is nine. So that's going to be nine. And one add nine. Now I'm going to put the biggest number first. It's easier. Nine add one. Well, some of bonds are ten. That's going to be that's going to be ten. So this one's nine. This one's ten. Which one's worth more? Which way is it going to go? Yeah, seven add two is less than one add nine. Try another one. One more. One more. No more. Uh, nine add seven, and eight take away f eight. Sorry, eighteen take away four. Now again, it's a bit like last time. You might just look at that and go, "Yeah, that's more." It's got a big number in it. But just work them out. Pause the video. Work it out. Okay, you might have the answers now. You might have paused the video. I'm going to work them out. So not, I'm going to work with this one first. Nine add seven. Now, do you know what I know with nine? I can get to the next friendly number and get to 10 just by adding 1. So if I break that 7 into 1 and something, I'll get me the answer. So 9 adds 7. Here's 9. Here's 7. If I only use one of them, then 7 just becomes 6. So 10 and 6, 16. So this one is 16. 18 take away 4. 4, 18 take away 4, let's do that one. Here's 18, 10 and 8 take away 4. Now I know that 8, this is 8, this is an 8 here, and if I know if I take away 4, it only leaves with 8. If you take away 4, it only leaves 4, doesn't it? So the answer is going to be 10 and 4, 14. So the answer is 14. So this one's 16, this one's 14. Which way is it going to go? 9 add 7 is greater than 18 take away 4. Okay, last thing today. Here we go. Oh, short one today. Last thing today. So we, we were looking at last time vertical addition, but with no tricky columns. Maybe you did this on your own as well. I've unticked the having some tricky columns. I'm not having that today. Okay. Um, uh, and what it is, year ones don't won't have done this probably uh, before. Um, but year twos definitely have. So 34 add 42. We're going to write that. This is um, written as a, a, a horizontal calculation. 34 add 42. We have to be able to turn that into a vertical calculation, into a column addition, put it into columns. 
34 add 42. Could you get your piece of paper and pencil now and write that, because you saw this last time, write that as 34 add 42 but in column edition. Okay. Maybe you pause the video and just hang on a second. Okay. 34 add 42. I'm trying to move my mouse slower this time because I felt like I whizzed around all over the place last time. So 34, going over here, add 42. Right. I've lined up the ones. The ones are on this side. Here's your ones. Here's the tens. So 4 add 2. 4 add 2 is? Yes, yeah, 6. There we go. Now, this looks like 3 add 4, but really its value is 30 add 40. So we drag those down. 30 add 40 is 7. So 34 add 42 is 76. Okay, I'll try another one. Okay, now, guys, 25 add 21. Can you write that on your piece of paper, please? Can you uh, maybe pause the video, write 25 add 21? Okay, 25 add 21. 25 add 21. Right, check that you've written it like this, and then you could pause the video again. Pause the video again and work the answer out for me. 25 add 21. Work out the answer, and then we'll look at it together afterwards. Okay, 5 add 1 is 6. 20 add 20 is... 40. So 25 add 21 is 46. Here's your big equals. 25 add 21 equals 46. Okay, one more. 31 add 34. Okay, guys, pause the video. Write 31 add 34. Write it like it is here first, and then write it as a column addition, as a vertical addition. Okay, here we go. 31 add 34. Right, guys, again, now that you've checked that you've written it like me, can you work it out? Pause the video and work it out. Pause the video and work it out yourself. Okay, uh, back with me now. So 1 add 4. So I'm going to 1 add 4 is 5. Feels like 3 add 3, but remember the value of it is 30 add 30. 30 add 30 is 60. So 31 add 34 equals 65. Good job, guys. Fantastic. Now, last time I said I'd put the link to this in the um, end card, but I realised I'm not allowed to use end cards um, uh, on this because um, uh, it's uh, videos for children. So it's... Um, I'll, I'll, again, I'll put the link in the box at the bottom, a bit below this video. So if you want to have another go at this, so your job, guys, is to get a piece of paper. When it starts, it looks like this. Please untick the tricky columns, please, unless you're feeling super confident in year two. Definitely year ones are trying this. Definitely untick the tricky columns. Um, and then write it out like this. And then write it out as a vertical you don't have to write all these tens and ones. You can just write the, num the, the numbers. Okay, write it out as a vertical, and then and then work out the answer. And afterwards, so no cheating. After you've worked out the answer, then come and drag these down afterwards to find out if you were right. Okay, good job, guys. Now your reward today is you get on your bike a button on your handlebars. And when you push that, say you're cycling along through some rough terrain, through some rough rocks and, and mud, when you press that button, <laughs> have you seen like monster trucks? Monster trucks have really big tyres. Your tyres inflate to enormous size and you can go over really um, difficult bumps and, and even maybe cycle in the water, float across the surface of the water. Here we go. Uh, not an actual prize. Okay, and don't do that. <laughs> Thanks for coming. Uh, see you next time.